Hello, my gorgeous babes. Um, my name's Melissa. If you're new here, hello and welcome. If you aren't subscribed, click the subscribe button and the notification bell. Um, I know tomorrow's Thanksgiving and stuff, and it's so that will be the end of my giveaway, and I'll be announcing the winner on Friday, like I've been saying, and stuff. So hurry up and get in, because my god, I'm almost at 40 now entries, and I totally realized that. It's going to cost me a lot. because I forgot that I am not doing international, but oh well, I will be doing it then. <laughs> Is this going to cost me a little pretty penny if the person I get and stuff. And I did forget to mention that when I do, I announce the winner and everything. If you could either leave me your Instagram tag, Facebook tag, or your email. And I will message you and get all your information from there. So... I totally spaced out on that. I am so horrible. I haven't done a giveaway in a while and stuff. Um, so I know the last one was the name change thing. I wasn't really tripping on it because I wasn't going to get that many people to put in. So at least the person that got it. Um, yeah. But I know my next giveaway, unfortunately, is going to be only U.S. Unfortunately, because it's going to probably cost me an arm and a leg. Because I plan on doing another one when I hit 500. Guys, I am so close. I am so close. So you guys could please help me get there. I would truly appreciate it. But, um, I just, the palette I wanted to use today's video is MIA. Don't know where it is. It's stuck in limbo somewhere. I did message the company that I bought it from and everything, but it's not here. It's stuck back east. I'm in the West Coast, and it's like in Washington, D.C. Washington, D.C. That's not very close to California. So, yeah, it's back there. Um, so, I was thinking, because I just... I had this for a little while, and I never played with it, but it's um, a hydro liner and stuff, and I wanted to try it. I was thinking of doing a gray eyeshadow, just matte and a pot of a shimmer in the eye but with some blue maybe purple liner just have fun and um yeah and i was thinking of using my jeffree star cremated palette i love this one it's like my favorite one of his so because i'm a goffy girl and i like it even though i haven't been dressing that way lately i just been kind of bleh but i'm not wearing anything because i don't want to fight with my makeup much and everything and I know I'm gonna be messing up my bangs so I can work but um I'm just want to do a really simple smoky kind of eye kind of we'll see where this goes and then do a bold um kind of a mixture of the two blues maybe see how those these two blues to see what colors they are there's like a light blue and dark blue and these two look so much like I think this is more of a reddish orange and that's more of an orange because there's a hot pink and then there's purple and then there's a green and it's a very odd combination. I got it off Amazon and stuff. Um, I do have two types of um, things I'm going to try. There's this liner one and I know this one's meant for brows but it has an angle to it. So I was thinking maybe that one trying it. And I have my two brushes for my eyeshadow. Um, so I'm thinking today's eyeshadow primer will be... Did I put them all the way? I'm just going to use the ColourPop one again. Um, I know I've been really bad on writing down everything I use. So um, after this video, I'm going to sit down. Because this is going up the same day I'm doing it. Because I've been so busy. And you will see in tomorrow's video, it's been pre-recorded because I was going to do this yesterday. And yeah, that didn't happen because I'm trying to make something special for my stepdad. And I did not realize, me forgetting, that um, the thing I'm making was going to basically incinerate my hands and burn them. And if I touch anything, it would burn. I'm making something because he's uh, Mexican. So I want to make him something authentic, and yeah, I totally forgot to put gloves on. So my hands felt like a hot tamale. 
flaming or hot jalapeno. It wasn't pleasant. So, um, I'm going to dust on life insurance, the lighter gray. Oh, Jesus, Lord, Jocelyn! All over my brow and crease area. So this is going to be just very simple. This primer isn't so bad, but they should bring out a white one. That would be really nice. Let me see how that works. I like having a white. Okay. I think I'm going to go in with um, Wednesday just to deepen up the crease and I'm just going to put down um, Gravedigger or R.I.P. Probably the combination of the two. We'll see. using that fluffy brush I'm gonna go in with the two colors just tapping back and forth and I'm gonna pack that onto the lid and I do have a lump on my eye Yeah, it just sucks because it's a palette I really want to use. It as a holiday palette, and it's really pretty and all, but yeah, that ain't coming. I hopefully it comes real soon, and it's not lost because it's been sitting in Washington D.C. for almost a few days, close to a week, and I've received other palettes that I bought just recently. Oh, we'll see. And those colors just blend together like there's nothing there. I think I'm going to use a little bit of uh, hers, just the black, just so I can deepen up the outer corner. Okay, that's a little too light. And bring it. I'm just trying to darken up that outer portion. See now there's a slight difference. And I think there is a loose hair. Nope, there's a cat hair. And the joy of owning cats. I may put in a little bit of, uh, of that life insurance into here just to pop it a little bit more because it's not yeah that's better so i'm gonna go between the two a little bit of hurt on the outer and kind of smoosh it and then blend it out with so they all kind of like diffuse together a little bit Sorry, my daughter's very talkative right now. I have asked to be quiet, please. She has headphones on, that's why she can't hear me. I'm not trying to bring anything into the lower area because I don't have any makeup on yet. On the bottom. Alright, so there is the simple eye look. And it's not too bad. But I will put the... Uh, shimmer on later so uh, let's close that up so it doesn't get ruined by any water move it out of the way all right so let's see what i can create i've never used hydro liners before so bear with me i think the lighter blue would be the better of the two
if I have to, I will add a little bit of Actually, I think I'm going to do is have the lighter blue right in the lighter color area. And sorry, I got a text message. A lot of hall. I may do the other. I'm just going to do the one eye right now. And then, um, yeah do the other one off camera because this is going to take a long long time and I don't want to have this a real long video all right I'm going to mull in the two. Oh, that's really pretty and wing it up just a little bit I'm horrible at this yeah I'm just learning I'm not very good at this. Okay, that's really cute. I'm gonna go over the blue, lighter blue. I do have a tower right here. Just in case I need it. That got a little watery. Oh, that really got watery. That got really watery. Okay, that's really cute. I like that. And, um, I'll see how I can do. I actually did a really good job at that wing. Holy smokes, guys. Yeah, I got some in my eyes because I watered up. Alright, so there is the wing and dark eyeshadow look. So give me one moment and I'll be right back. Um, I just want to keep it really simple. So let me do the rest of my makeup and recreate it on the other eye. Please, hopefully I can do this. Um, i trying to think what lipstick I want to wear. So I may wear just a black lipstick. Or red. We'll see. Or neutral. So give me one second I'll be right back. Alright guys, so here is the final look. Not bad. I did a little touch up of the color and stuff and reapplied some of the liner due to the lashes playing games on me. But I think this is really cute and stuff. I really like it. Um, so my lashes are from CR Lashes in the style Pandora. Um, really pretty. Um, I'm using an LA Girl uh, Shockwave in Electric just for the bottom because I didn't know how I would feel with um, using the Hydro Liner in my waterline so that's what I did and then I used some of the colors and the uh, diamond ashes for my inner corner to give it a pop um, but yeah all my other face products will be down below um, my lipstick is but of roses from wet and wild it was their collection of rose thing and the really cute brushes which I have back there um, and I use disco queen to add a little pop underneath too but um, yeah everything else will be like I said down below whatnot and if you don't look there and stuff and you're on my Instagram you guys will see the picture and stuff too of it but um not bad I'm not a huge fan of the lipstick because it's not a drying it's a shine but I wanted something kind of a purpley pink just to give it a little pop but um I don't mind it it's really cute um I hope you guys like this video and if you guys do give it a like down below leave comments whatnot I truly appreciate it um, if you want to, you can follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. I do try to air multiple times out of the week. Um, but I hope you're all doing good, especially on this Thanksgiving weekend and everything. And having fun with your family and stuff. Um, and staying safe. 
and I love you guys. Until next time, okay? Bye!